Hi, welcome to my model course. Today we are making a miniature halter with our DIY kit. So let's dive right in. In this tutorial we are making a halter for Breyer Horse's traditional scale 1 9. It's exactly the same process for leather ribbon or for any halter scale 1 20th like Schleich, it's just smaller. First, let's see what's inside the kit. He has a real rondo jump rings and halter buckles, miniature pins, ribbon or leather, and thread. You also have the instructions included. Now let's start crafting. Cut a piece of ribbon of 2.6 cm for Schleich and 4 cm for Breyer. Take one of the halter rings. Thread the ribbon through the ring. Put glue on the end of the ribbon. Fold it over and glue it down to have a tab around your halter ring. Secure with a miniature pin. Slide the other halter ring through the other end of the ribbon. And fold the end of the ribbon on itself to form the top of the nose band. The right length is when the ribbon goes from one cheekbone to the other. Apply some glue. Secure with a pin. Now let's make the cheek straps. Cut two pieces of ribbon of 1.8 cm for Schleich and 2.5 cm for Breyer. Slide it through one of the top sides of the halter ring to form a right angle. Pad glue. Fold the ribbons in onto itself and tab it down. Secure with a pin. Repeat the same thing for the second cheek straps. Now take two jump rings. The length of the cheek strap has to go from the halter ring until behind the eye. Slide a jump ring through the end of the ribbon. Glue the rest of the ribbon down on itself. Repeat on the other side. Make sure both straps have the same length. Let's finish the nose band. Cut two pieces of ribbon of 1.5 cm and one of 2 cm for Schleich. Or two ribbons of 2.5 cm and one of 3 cm for Breyer. Slide one of the shorter ribbons through a jump ring, glue it down on itself. Repeat with the second short one. Glue the longer piece of ribbon in between. You should get a jump ring with three ribbons attached to it. Let it dry. Now you will have to connect and glue down the shorter ribbons to the halter ring to form the nose band. Measure the loop around the nose of your horse before gluing. The nose band must not be too tight or too loose. Cut the excess off and glue it down.
time to make the throat latch. Thread the ribbon through the left jump rings at the end of the cheek strap. Pull it down. To form the throat latch, take the end of the ribbon and thread it through the other jump rings. Now pull it. Make sure there is no twist in it. Put the halter on your horse's head and measure. The jump ring must be underneath the eye. Make a mark. Leave extra lengths to glue the ribbon down and cut off the excess ribbon. Let's add the connection strip. Take your ribbon left in the nose band, the one in the middle. Fold the end over to form a sliding loop around the throat latch. Apply a small dot of glue right to this tab and then press it down. Now we need the buckle. Take the buckle. Thread the ribbon through the center bar. The ribbon goes under, over the central bar and under again. Glue it down. Now cut a piece of ribbon of 1.5 cm for slight and 2.5 cm for braille. The buckle should look like this. Finally the crown piece. Cut a piece of ribbon of 5 cm for slight and 8 cm for braille. Slide it through the left jump ring. Fold it and glue it down. Now put the halter on your horse. Pull the ribbon over its head. Thread the ribbon through the top part of the buckle to measure the length. Cut off the excess of ribbon, leaving an extra part for the top. Fold the end of the ribbon in itself and glue it down. Slide the ribbon through the buckle end. Your halter is done. Open a jump ring with a plier. Attach it to the hook and close it. Slide your cord through the ring and then glue it down. Secure with a pin and let it dry. Cut a small piece of ribbon to wrap around the rope for a neat result. Then just clip the hook onto the halter. If the hook is too tight, open it gently with your plier. And you're done. We hope you enjoyed this tutorial and that this halter will be the first of many. If you like tag making, don't forget to check out our website for more tag kits, collect and model horses, and 3D prints. Bye!